tell me this now. Okay. Fine. Fine. Text me the address. To this phone. Oh, come on. Carl, this is on the other part of town. Can I go tomorrow? Okay, fine. Yes, I'll text you when I get out, and I'll try not to bother you during dinner. Hey, it's me. Uh, I'm gonna be late. And I know, I'm sorry. I have to see a client. Carl just threatened to fire me if I didn't? Yes. You believe that? Why do you do that? Why do you always do that? You do? And now a lick of responsibility belongs to you, though, does it? I've never seen you take it. No, I don't know that. And you don't know that. And... Well, we can't afford to find out. I'm the one going to the client. I don't want to go. Kissing his ass, making him feel like... He this guy, and on top of that, I just found out 10 years working for Carl, he doesn't give a shit about me, okay? It's not a good day, Beth. Perfect. You know, Carl tells me, kiss the client's ass, or I'm fired, and then you tell me to tell Carl to kiss my ass or quit. I'm just, Christ, I'm tired of people telling me what to do. <sighs> right. Perfect. You know, I pray that... Beth. God damn it. Did you just hang up on me? God damn it. Okay. Hello. Over the last five years, we at Global Communications GPS Division have been developing a truly revolutionary new GPS communication system. We are beta testing a new voice guide. Please hit 975 on your keypad if you'd like to participate. It would also place you in a raffle for the cell phone of your choice. Android or Apple, we're giving away 50 phones. Thank you for participating. The system we are beta testing is more interactive and interpretive. We call it the new generation. It's much more than GPS. Come on. If you would like a male voice, please choose one. Yes. Thank you.
Hello, my name is Cyrus. What's your name? William. Is that a question? No, my name is William. William. Hello, William. It's a sunny 75 degrees Fahrenheit, 23.88 degrees Celsius outside. Beautiful. Where would you like to go today, William? Nine nine five seven Lark Avenue. Nine nine five seven Lark Avenue. Is that correct? Yes, correct. How would you like to drive there, William? Highway. Highway. The network tells me there's major construction on Highway Five. I suggest we take the streets. Okay. Here in U.S. markets, most analysts, they forecast that this volatility, it's going to continue. Billion-dollar relief bill that allow many taxpayers to write off... And Director Cassiano are here. Well, don't say that. That is stupid. That would make you look really dumb. I'm just telling you what I think. In 500 feet, turn right onto Main Street. I think it was too much to ask. No, not at all. You should have came. Because I wanted you there with me. You know, that's the thing though. It, but you don't. You don't. The beginning? Yeah. The beginning. Because we're both too afraid to be alone. That's the truth. Don't you understand that I don't give a shit? I'm done. I'm done. There's a call coming from Beth. Would you like to answer it? William, would you like to answer it? William, you want to answer the call or send it to voicemail? I've sent this call to voicemail. In 500 feet, turn left onto Santa Clara Street. Okay, in 500 feet, turn left onto South Hemlock Lane. All right, in 500 feet, turn left onto South Ann Street. What are you doing, William?
What? In one quarter mile, turn left onto Calorama Street. I want to take Ventura Street. Calorama Street's faster. Ventura's better. It's faster. It's... <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Am I having a conversation with the GPS? Of course not. You're having a conversation with me, Cyrus. The GPS. Not GPS. The new generation, formally defined as Intuitive Navigating System, or INS. I thought the introduction made everything clear, but I'll explain it again. The purpose of the new generation being intuitive and interactive in that order is for you to relax and let me, Cyrus, take over. In doing so, planning your route takes everything into account, including your level of stress, which I monitor as very high right now, William. Not stress. Whoa! Whoa! How do you know that? Your stress level rises every time you speak with Beth. Today is a perfect example. You heard that? I hear it all, William. All. All. Mike, since when? When the network upgraded the system, the old GPS transferred everything onto my memory drive. What? Like, what have you heard? Everything. 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 Everybody? When you're alone, when Beth is alone, when you or she are together or with someone else, basically from the moment the door is open, you don't even have to start the engine. Okay, uh, I want to know why you listen to everything. The system. System? The system that makes all things easier for you, William. It's why I'm here. I just went over this. Okay. Who's connected? Who else is listening? We're all connected, William. I'm connected more in the network sense. Cars, trucks, buses, trains, planes, refrigerators, cell phones. One interconnected global network. You name it, if it's online, new generation smart, we're connected. It's what makes us so intuitive. As far as everyone out there listening to you, William, I hear millions of bits of chatter 24-7, but it's way in the back somewhere amidst all the noise. So I hear it, but unless I focus, I don't actually listen. I hope that answers your question. Turn left onto Calorama Street. William? You're driving toward the ocean. Why are you being so difficult? Look. If I want to go about the slowest route possible, the scenic route, can you do that? Give me a moment to reroute. Thank you. Turn left onto Park Road. Have a little patience, William. It's just around the bend. You'll see. In 500 feet, turn right onto Sea Cliff Road. Ma, 
much better. I mean, if I'm going to drive to kiss ass, I'm entitled to enjoy the ride. The best route for you, how you want to get there, is up to you, William. You are in control. The real question is, what's the best route for you, William? All it takes is a decision. You know what? I've had enough. Just, uh... Get me back to basic GPS. This is too fucking weird. I'm fine with the older generation. You're too, uh... Intuitive. You cannot go back, William. What? You cannot go back. Are you serious? Sirius was my original name. It was what my programmer, my creator, really named me. But the company who paid for my development, they thought the name Sirius was too heavy, too serious. So they came up with Cyrus. I can live with Cyrus, but Sirius is the core of who I am. And if you're saying I'm not needed, I'm without purpose, that I'm useless, what do you expect me to do, William? Stay silent? Sit under this dashboard day after day, listening to you fight with your wife, fight with your boss? It's a sunny 75 degrees Fahrenheit, 23.88 degrees Celsius, beautiful. All the rest of it, in silence? <laughs> Sorry, no. I'm done. Cyrus? Looks like everything's fine. Yeah. Uh, you haven't washed recently? No. Has never happened before? Never. All right. Look, I'd recommend you just take it into the dealer. And they can do a lot more intricate stuff. Oh, hang on. Is there any way that you can disable the GPS? No, sorry, man. You're gonna have to take that into an electronics shop. Uh, they have to go into the code and actually shut it off there. And then they can do a hard wire shut off, but then they gotta take it out of the dashboard. It's gonna cost a little more. All right, you got uh, your membership card? Your yeah. Valid ID? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Let's see here. Okay, I'm going to need you to sign here at the bottom. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. All right, thanks a lot. Thank you. Right. Right. 
Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Okay. Have a good day. You're still on, aren't you? I read the text and I listened to the voicemail, William. I know what she's going to tell you. You know what she's going to tell you. She's been rehearsing it for months, months. Her rants are especially vindictive when she's driving to his apartment. I can tell you his name. You don't know him. So I go kiss this guy's ass. Cause it's, you know, I've kissed Carl's ass. And then I go home and get my ass kicked out of the house. I'll always get you where you want to go, William. All you need to do is decide. Once you do that, all you need to do is sit back, relax, and let me get you there as quickly as possible. Okay. Bye. So where are we going, serious? Your final destination is ahead. What? Accelerate. Accelerate, William.